That's my great, great pleasure to welcome all of you today to our LipidMap Spring School. And we are all very excited to start our one week long event full of lipids and lipidomics. So as you know, the school will focus on the theoretical and also some practical aspects of lipid biology and biochemistry with a strong focus on lipidomics analysis describing and going over different state-of-the-art approaches. It was uh, my great pleasure to organize this event together with Valerie O'Donnell and uh, a special thanks I would like to say also to our technical support and organizer behind all those activities which we had to undergo before uh, today, so Carolyn and Jeff. And uh, this event would not be possible if 33 top level experts all over the world in lipid biology and lipidomics kindly agreed to participate and provide their lectures, presentation, tutorials and discussions. And I'm pretty sure this uh, top level names which we had in our program from the very beginning uh, is the reason that we were able to attract almost 500 participants who registered for the school. So, and uh, the participants for the school are coming all over the world, so from Americas, Europe, and Asia uh, sites. So that's why the times we try to distribute in the way that it will fit uh, for everyone. So over these five days uh, of a school, uh, we prepared for you the program, which is uh, structured in the different sections, as you probably already saw in the program. And we will start today with introduction to lipid biology and biochemistry, with describing different lipid category, categories and the diversity of the lipidomes, natural lipidomes. After this, we will switch to the more practical aspect of lipid analysis and talk about mass spectrometry-based lipidomics. And here we also have an impressive lineup of speakers who will describe you all different ways how nowadays we can analyze lipids using shotgun or LCMS-based approaches for lipid identification and quantification. On the day three, we will have several excellent presentations about uh, advanced technology in lipidomics, including mass spectrometry imaging and ion mobility. As you can imagine, this uh, variety of mass spectrometry based techniques produce a vast uh, amount of data. So the next logical step would be to use different uh, biostatistical tools to analyze and get a sense out of those data. So we have several talks uh, which will illustrate application of biostatistics, visualization and systems biology approaches for lipidomics. We will have also several presentations from uh, LipidMaps members uh, talking about different shorthand nomenclature and also the capabilities and a structure of lipid maps databases. And finally, uh, we will have also tutorials on bioinformatic tools in lipidomics. So you will have this unique chance during this one week event, not only to learn how to do uh, mass spectrometry based lipidomics, but also see 12 different tools which are all open access and can be used by anyone to analyze and process those big omics data for lipid analysis. Uh, despite the fact that we have uh, our event in the online format due to the uh, pandemic, which we have all over the world, we still try to make it a bit more interactive. And for that, we planned uh, three questions and answer sessions, starting uh, with one today, later on. And the idea here is really to uh, have some interaction with you as participants and the speakers of the session in this day will be available as well as all of us to really discuss and ask the questions which you maybe always had in your mind, but now you really have a chance. So this kind of activity and interactivity of our school will depend first of all of you as a uh, based uh, on you as a participant. So please don't be shy and try to get a uh, maximum out of this online event. Additionally, today we have also our poster presentations and we have uh, 46 uh, 
abstracts for the uh, poster flash presentation by our participants. We will host it as parallel sessions via breakout rooms. And you could see here five topics which they will cover. So lipid in health and disease, metabolism, technologies in lipidomics, infection, inflammation, bioinformatics and modified lipids. So stay uh, with us till the end of the day. At least visit the posters and you will also have a possibility to ask questions and discuss it with the presenters. So since our event is taking place online, there are a few housekeeping rules which I would like to mention before we start. And so all events during the week will take place uh, online using a Zoom platform for which you all received the link. And due to the large number of participants we have, I would like to ask you to keep your microphone and camera, so microphone muted and camera off all the time, except you want to ask a question or provide a comment. It's just to the technical reasons that we uh, have a good connection and there is no uh, background noise all the time. Uh, during lectures and presentation, please write your questions in the chart and the chair of the session will always will um, keep an eye on that. And at the end of the lecture presentation, session chair will collect the question and will ask you um, to unmute yourself and ask your question in person. So if we have, and I hope we have more questions uh, than we can answer and uh, due to the time constraint, we will collect all of those questions from the chart and bring them with us to the Q&A sessions when uh, they will be asked and discussed with the speakers. So again, uh, please uh, go on with your question as much as you want and uh, use your chance to ask and to communicate even uh, in this online platform way. We will also have some breakout rooms for the networking, which will be available during the break. So if you want to discuss something with someone, there will be option uh, to do that. And at the end of the school, we will ask you to provide us some feedback um, on the event, how you liked it and what was good, what was not. So and for that, uh, you will be provided uh, with a link or some explanation how to access the questionnaire form. Uh, we also would like to thank uh, very much our sponsors who supported this event. Uh, this is Lipotype, Syx, and Brooker. And you will also have a chance to hear the talks from the corresponding companies, which will be um, tomorrow, given by Kristen, Rebecca, and Sven. So please do not miss uh, this and uh, to learn what is going on from the companies. So I would also like to acknowledge uh, several partnership which uh, Lipid Maps has already for a long time. And this is with Avanti and Kaiman. There will be also presentation by the uh, people from those companies uh, during this week. And we are also very happy and very uh, grateful for the support provided by International Lipidomic Society and Lipidomic Standard Initiative. As you will see many speakers who will be presenting the really cutting edge research in the lipidomics to use this week are from uh, International Lipidomic Society and Lipidomic Standard Initiative. So finally, I would like to mention also that many of us here are the members of EpiLipidNet, and this is a new uh, pan-European network dedicated to the lipidomics and epilipidomics analysis, but also biological data integration. So if you would like to know more about EpiLipidNet, just you can visit the website. And I guess with that, uh, that was pretty much all for the start. And I wish all of us a very exciting week, full of interesting events and uh, nice discussions.